Motor Yacht A is a superyacht designed by Philippe Stark and engineered by naval architect Martin Francis. It was built by the Blome Plus Vos shipyard at the HDW Deepwater facility in Kiel. It was ordered in November 2004, and delivered in 2008 at a rumored cost of US$300 million, with a length of 119 meters feet and displacing almost 6,000 tons, it is one of the largest motor yachts in the world. It is owned by Russian self-made entrepreneur and industrialist Andrei Melnichenko. It is reported the name A was used in order to make the vessel appear first on shipping registers, while the design is largely based on advanced nautical engineering and maritime technology which accounts for many benefits including waveless cruising. It has evoked comparisons with submarines and stealth warships prompting Forbes magazine to wax that the vessel was designed by Philippe Stark and resembles a sleek, futuristic submarine. According to Wallpaper magazine, few designers have done more to reshape the identity of the modern superyacht than Stark with his naval architecture and design. According to Boat International, My A can accommodate 14 guests in its seven guest cabins, and is designed for 35 crew members on board. A is powered by two man RK280 diesel engines providing approximately 9,000 kilowatts 12,000 horsepower, sufficient to give the yacht a maximum speed of 23 knots 43 kilometers per hour, 26 miles per hour. At her cruising speed of 19 knots 35 kilometers per hour, 22 miles per hour, she can cover 6,500 nautical miles 12,000 kilometers 7,500 miles in under 16 days before her 750,000 L, 160,000 imp gal, 200,000 US gal fuel tank is empty. Typically for a mega yacht, A is decorated, equipped, and staffed to an extremely opulent standard. There is almost 24,000 square feet 2,200 square meters of interior space, including 2,500 square feet 230 square meters for the master suite. Stark, known for his occasionally risque design choices, also added a secret room hidden behind mirrored panels. Mirrored surfaces feature extensively throughout the interior, along with Baccarat crystal which is used not only for the glassware and tableware, but for the furniture too. There are seven guest cabins, although they have moving walls and can be converted to four larger staterooms. Above deck there is a helipad and swimming pool forward of the superstructure and two more pools aft, one of which is glass-bottomed and can be viewed from the below-deck disco. Share vessel type luxury yacht series owner the Ritz Carlton Hotel Company Keel laying January 2018 maiden voyage February 2020 length 190 meters passenger capacity 298 the Ritz Carlton yacht collection is a series of new custom built luxury yachts being offered by the Ritz Carlton Hotel Company. The first ship in the collection is under construction at the Ejos de J Barreras shipyard in Vigo, Spain. Designed to provide a unique experience for its guests, the yacht collection aims to transform the luxury cruising industry. The keel laying ceremony of the first of three yachts was held in January 2018, followed by the hull launch in October 2018. The first yacht is expected to sail on her maiden voyage in 2020. Ritz-Carlton Yacht Collection design and accommodation Each yacht of the collection will have an overall length of 190 meters, a width of 23.8 meters, and a gross tonnage of 26,500 t. It will have the capacity to accommodate 298 passengers in 149 stylish suites and will also carry 246 crew members and officers. Ritz-Carlton Yachts will provide different accommodation options for its guests including 58 square meters view suites, 65 square meters loft suites, 59 square meters grand suites, 44 square meters signature suites, and 29 square meters terrace suites. Each ship will also offer accessible suites, connecting suites, and convertible suites. The 102 square meters luxury owner's penthouse suite will feature a private terrace, convertible sofa bed and dining area. It will also accommodate a second bathroom with a modern shower system. Common amenities and services across all the suites will include 24-hour dining service, vanity mirror, hairdryer, Wi-Fi, TV, in-suite safe, hypoallergenic pillows, espresso machine, and charging ports. Luxury bath amenities, individual robe, and slippers will be provided for guests. Ritz-Carlton Yacht Collection Deck details the yacht will feature eight passenger decks, from deck 3 to 10. Deck 3 will house the marina and the marina terrace for drinks and snacks. Deck 4 will feature meeting rooms, living room, boutique, main dining, and dining privé. The fifth deck will have a pool, loft suites, and terrace suites. Decks 6, 7, and 8 will offer guest suites, as well as a range of bars and restaurants. 
Deck 9 will feature gym, fitness studio, barber, salon, laundrette and medical center. Deck 10 will house the observation lounge, which will provide spectacular views of the sea. It will also be equipped with a helipad. The Ritz-Carlton Yacht Collection will feature a wide range of restaurants and bars. Talat Nam on board the yacht will be a contemporary restaurant offering Southeast Asian cuisine. It will also feature a sushi bar and provide outdoor seating. The yacht will be powered by an electric propulsion system integrating two Azipod D propulses and motors. It will also be installed with remote diagnostic service, which will enhance the maintenance. The Ability System 800XA will provide the crew with single-screen access to the information to efficiently control and operate the ship. Kalila is one of the most striking superyachts for sale, thanks to her abstract all-carbon, gold exterior which has been turning heads since her 2015 launch. Built by Palmer Johnson, Kalila was the first hull in the yard's new Supersport series, and the first all-carbon superyacht ever built. Her dynamic lines and a revolutionary hull have been carefully designed to create a new breed of displacement yacht. Capable of reaching 26 knots, she combines performance and space to offer a serious cruising experience. Kalila is in impeccable condition and has been perfectly maintained by her current owner. Exclusively for sale with Super Yachts Monaco, this cutting-edge motor yacht is in a class of her own thanks to her fusion of design, technology and performance. Kalila Performance A high-performance sports yacht, Kalila's carbon composite construction is designed to offer optimal fuel consumption when cruising at high speeds with no need for zero-speed stabilizers thanks to her 10.8 meters beam. Powered by twin 16 volts MTU diesel M94 engines, she has an impressive top speed of 26 knots and boasts a transatlantic range when cruising at 15 knots. Guest capacity on Kalila. Offering a uniquely versatile interior layout, Kalila can accommodate up to 11 guests across her five spacious staterooms, which include two spacious master suites. Ultra luxurious in style, the master staterooms are situated forward on the main deck. Light and open, the master staterooms are finished with bleached birch wood paneling and feature full-length picture windows offering panoramic views. Located on the lower deck, Kalila's stylish and modern guest accommodation includes two VIP staterooms plus a twin cabin with a Pullman bed. Decorated in soft tones and featuring an individual accent color, each of the guest staterooms also enjoys ensuite bathroom facilities. Kalila also has a generously sized crew mess plus accommodation for a nine-person crew on the lower deck. Kalila interior styled by the in-house team at Palmer Johnson, Kalila S interior blends contemporary chic with a distinct Asian influence. Huge windows flood the living space with light while a mix of simple and sculpted interior lines creates a rich palette of textures throughout. On the main deck, a Karelian birch wood bar leads into Kalila's vast full beam salon. Framed by floor-to-ceiling picture windows and featuring a contemporary LED light installation, glass doors led from the salon to a covered dining area on the vast aft deck beyond. Kalila's exterior designed without compromise, Kalila S sleek exterior was created by Palmer Johnson's in-house design team. Pairing a pared-down superstructure with bold lines and a state-of-the-art wave-penetrating bow, Kalila is in the design and development of Aqua, our team derived inspiration from owners' lifestyles, the fluid versatility of water and cutting-edge technology, combining all of this in a 112 meter superyacht with truly innovative features. On board, the interrelated requirement for privacy and space has been addressed with an extraordinarily large owner's pavilion. To accentuate the link with the water, much thought has been devoted to making the ocean as accessible and visible as possible. At the lower decks, the usual parameters for propulsion, range and speed have been translated into a complete hydrogen electric system, whose physical dimensions and operational characteristics reinforce a comprehensively innovative superyacht experience. At Sino, our highly talented designers offer more than just a design style. We always integrate all aspects of design into a new build, this means acknowledging key questions such as, why build a yacht in the first place, and, how can we ensure that you will enjoy your investment and enrich your sense of freedom? Aqua is focused on an environmentally sensitive subject, yacht propulsion and the choice of fuel. Propulsion systems have become highly optimized over the past few years, diesel-electric combinations in many configurations and setups have grown in popularity, with the goal of increasing efficiency and ultimately reducing emissions. To take this discussion into an entirely new realm we have initiated Aqua, our new yacht concept, using a hydrogen-electric system capable of catering for all onboard energy needs. 
The flowing exterior lines of aqua are inspired by ocean swells, the surge of energy induced by winds and currents, boosted by the gravitational forces that control the ocean's tides. Those fluid, free-flowing lines accentuate the freedom of life on the water and blend into their environment in complete harmony with nature. Aqua is configured with a with a five-deck setup, utilizing forward interior space through the high shear line which subtly descends from bow to aft. The yacht has been designed to provide those on board with the closest possible proximity to the water. The aft deck features a unique and innovative series of platforms cascading down towards the sea, while a large swim platform allows all aqua passengers to enjoy the optimal experience of accessing the water at sea level. The Indoor Health and Wellness Center is a water world of serenity, where the reflecting waves of the water feature complement the onboard environment with the soft, vibrating motion. Entering this world feels like a subtle spiritual transition, from the relaxed openness of the main lounge to the healing atmosphere of this aqua-typical spa. Aqua contains an exclusive hydro-massage room, where passengers can revel in massages administered by soothing, pressurized water jets. Hydro-massage therapy is extremely relaxing and is purported to help alleviate sports injuries as well as muscle and soft tissue ailments. Invented by the Romans, Hydro Massage remains one of the most popular, well-being enhancing Octopus is a 414-foot mega yacht owned by the Jody Allen controlled estate of the late Paul Allen. It is one of the world's largest yachts. Launched in 2003, Octopus is a private vessel that is regularly lent out for exploration projects, scientific research initiatives and rescue missions. Octopus has two helicopter two pads on the main deck, a twin pad and hangars at the stern and a single pad on the bow, and a 63-foot tender docked in the transom and a landing craft. There are a total of seven tenders aboard. The yacht also has a pool, located aft on one of its upper decks, and two submarines, one of them operated by remote control and capable of attaining greater depths. The latter was lent to Google Earth for the Explore the Ocean project, side hatches at the water line form a dock for personal watercraft. The exterior was designed by Espanoino Naval Architects and built by the German shipbuilders Lursen in Bremen and HDW in Kiel. The interior was by designer Jonathan Quinn Barnett of Seattle. Octopus was built in 2003 and refitted in 2008. Allen loaned Octopus, which is equipped with a submarine and ROV, for a variety of rescue and research operations. These include assisting in a hunt for an American pilot and two officers whose plane disappeared off Palau, and loaning his yacht to scientists to study the coelacanth, a living fossil that was once believed to be extinct. In January 2011, while en route to Antarctica, one of its helicopters was forced to make an emergency landing in the waters off the coast of Argentina. While the helicopter was severely damaged, there was no loss of life, with only the co-pilot suffering minor injuries. Allen was not aboard at the time. In 2012, he loaned the ship to the Royal Navy in their attempt to retrieve the ship's bell from the Admiral-class battlecruiser HMS Hood, which sank to a depth of 9,000 feet 2, meters in the Denmark Strait during World War II, as a national memorial. HMS Hood was hit by a shell from the German battleship Bismarck, its magazines exploded and the ship sank in minutes with a loss of over 1,400 lives. The bell was located but not recovered, due to adverse weather conditions. On 7 August 2015 it was announced that the bell from HMS Hood had been recovered by the ROV operating from Octopus. After conservation, the bell was put on display in 2016 at the National Museum of the Royal Navy Portsmouth, England. In March 2015, an Allen-led research team announced that it had found the Japanese battleship Musashi in the Sabuyan Sea off the coast of the Philippines. 8. Armed with 46 cm main guns and displacing 72,800 tons, 74,000 tons at full load, Musashi and its sister ship Yamato were the largest and most heavily armed battleships in naval history. From 2018 to July 2019, the yacht underwent a refit at Blome Plus Voss and is reportedly for sale with an asking price of 295 million euros. The 511 10 156 of a meter custom motor yacht motor yacht Dilbar was built by Lursen in Germany at their Lemwerder shipyard, she was delivered to her owner in 2016. The yacht's interior has been designed by Winch Design. Accommodation. Dilbar's interior configuration has been designed to comfortably accommodate up to 24 guests overnight in 12 cabins. She is also capable of carrying up to 96 crew on board in 53 cabins to ensure a relaxed luxury yacht experience. 
her generous deck areas play host to a wide range of amenities including an outdoor bar and ample space for sun lounging and relaxing. Construction and Dimensions Dilbar features a displacement steel hull and aluminium superstructure, with teak decks. She was built to Lloyd's Register Solis Safety of Life at Sea Classification Society rules. Performance. Powered by two Wartzeeler electric motor 12,000 kW diesel electric engines and propelled by her twin screw propellers motor yacht Dilbar is capable of a top speed of 22.5 knots and comfortably cruises at 18 knots. She can carry around 1,049,700 of diesel electric on board in her fuel tanks. Her water tanks store around 112,000 of fresh water. Amenities. Gym, jacuzzi, on deck, elevator, lift, helipad, swimming pool, tender garage, air conditioning, spa, sauna, cinema, separate crew passageway, swimming platform, underwater lights, massage room, outdoor bar. Special features her indoor pool holds a stunning 180 cubic meters of water and is commissioned by a Saudi Arabian businessman Sheikh Abdul Mosin Abdul Malik Al Sheikh. Polaris was built at the Lursen subsidiary repair shipyard in Schachtordorf Rendsburg, Germany. The conceptual design was completed in 1999, work began in 2000, and the yacht entered service in 2003. It was sold to Russian billionaire Roman Abramovich during its maiden voyage, who had it altered by Blohm and Voss, adding a second helicopter pad on top of the wheelhouse, two B and V active fin stabilizers replaced by 4-0 speed stabilizers, and modifications to the underwater exhaust, mast, and stern. Polaris is powered by two Wartzeeler, formerly Stork Workspur, 12 V26 engines designed to give continuous 3,900 kilowatts at 1,000 R, P, M. On the Builder's Sea trial Polaris successfully reached the contract speed of 20 knots, but often cruises between 12 and 14 knots. While owned by Abramovich, the yacht had a full-time crew of up to 46, in addition to a large security contingent that traveled with his family. Polaris would cruise the western Mediterranean during the summers, and commonly ventured down through the Suez for the winters. In 2005, Abramovich lent Polaris to Frank Lampard and John Terry for two weeks as a bonus for being the two best players at his English football club Chelsea FC the previous season, and allowed Terry to honeymoon with his new wife, Tony Poole, on the yacht in 2007. Irina Abramovich received the yacht in 2009 as part of her divorce settlement. She sold it via broker Merlewood to David Geffen in 2011 for 300 million United States dollars. In 2011 Geffen sold Polaris to Sheikh Abdullah bin Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayyan for 214 million euros. In 2016 Polaris was sold to Chinese The striking 134-meter mega yacht Serene was built by the Italian shipyard Fincantieri and launched in 2011. She represents one of the largest vessels built in Italy to date and one of the largest vessels in the world. Her elegant exterior design work and engineering were completed by Espanino, who is amongst the world's top yacht designers. Raymond Langton Design completed her inspiring interior design. Not only she is great in proportion she is also one of the most sophisticated in style and features the latest, state-of-the-art technology. Serene has a maximum capacity to sleep up to 24 guests on board overnight, plus four bona fide supernumeraries. Notable features, tilde enormous internal sea water pool approximately two helipads, one of which converts to either a pool or dance floor tilde submarine tilde multiple pools and spa pools tilde snow room tilde steam room tilde jet stream swimming pool tilde several children's playrooms tilde climbing wall and between the decks slide tilde underwater viewing room tilde outdoor cinema tilde boardroom tilde piano room and bar tilde conference room tilde sauna tilde hammam tilde beauty center tilde swim platform tilde private swim platform with lift tilde beach club tilde dance floor tilde observation lounge with domed fireplaces tilde exhaustive list of yacht toys serene is a truly remarkable vessel which was designed to take her owners anywhere in the world in sublime luxury and ultimate comfort and safety spanning seven private decks she is in a class of her own on every level she provides a full seven decks of exterior and interior space and boasts a generous beam of 18 5 meters meaning she is an extremely high volume vessel Equipped with almost every system and amenity conceivable, she also features a relatively enormous internal sea water pool, two helicopter landing platforms, and storage for a large submarine which can also be modified for use as a comfortable internal tender docking station. 
Serene has an abundance of pools and spa pools, a snow room, a steam room plus hot and cold spa pools and a jet stream. A summary of Motor Yacht Al said the Motor Yacht Al said is a 155 meters 509 foot imposing steel ship which was crafted at Lursen Yachts and her design is by Lursen and Espanino. Sleeping 70 passengers and 154 crew members, Motor Yacht Al said was registered as Project Sunflower. This balanced boat was designed with the naval architecture of Lursen and Espanino. Espanino produced the interior design and styling. Motor Yacht Al Said was launched in 2007 for Sultan Said Qabas bin Said as Said of Oman, also known as Sultan Qaboos bin Said. The new build and design relating to luxury Yacht Al Said Lursen was the naval architecture company involved in the technical vessel design work for Al Said. Her interior design was realized by Espanino. Lursen and Espanino is also associated with the yacht wider design collaboration for this yacht. In 2007 she was formally launched to Accolade in Vegesac and following sea trials and detailing was thereafter delivered to the owner. Lursen Yachts completed the new build motor yacht in Germany. The main hull was crafted from steel. The motor yacht main superstructure is made extensively using aluminium. With a beam of 24 meters or 78.74 feet Al said has massive size. A fairly deep draft of 5.2 meters .06 feet limits the amount of certain marinas she can enter, depending on their minimum depth. The accommodation provided by Superyacht Al Said, Motor Yacht Al Said, built by Lursen, was ordered in 2006. The motor yacht was code named Project Sunflower during its construction. It's one of the world's largest superyachts, especially measured by volume. The yacht can accommodate 65 guests and 140 crew members. Al said is designed by Espanino. She is powered by two MTU marine engines. With a total of 22,000 horsepower. These bring her a cruise speed of 14 knots. Most of the time the royal yacht Al said is based in the Sultan Qaboos port. The port is close to Muscat. When she travels, she is escorted by the Oman Navy. The Sultan owned eight palaces and three luxury yachts. Al said, Fulk Al Salama and Lolat Al Bahar. Lalot al Bahar was actually the previous Al Said. It was given as a gift to Oman's Ministry of Tourism. She has been refitted and repainted. The 360 11 100 tenths of a meter custom motor yacht, motor yacht Radiant was built by Lursen in Germany at their Lemwerder shipyard. She was delivered to her owner in 2009. Previously named Darius, her luxurious interior was designed by Glenn Puschelberg. Accommodation. Radiant's interior configuration has been designed to comfortably accommodate up to 20 guests overnight in 10 cabins. She is also capable of carrying up to 44 crew on board to ensure a relaxed luxury yacht experience. Construction and dimensions. Radiant features a full displacement steel hull and aluminium superstructure, with teak decks. She was built to Germanischer Lloyd 100A5 motor yacht, MCAUT classification society rules. This luxury yacht is also fitted with zero-speed stabilizers which work at anchor, increasing onboard comfort when the yacht is stationary, particularly in rough waters. Performance. Powered by two MTU 16 volts 1163 TB73L 8715 horsepower diesel engines and propelled by her twin screw propellers motor yacht Radiant is capable of a top speed of 21 knots, and comfortably cruises at 16 knots. She can carry around 360,000 liters of diesel on board in her fuel tanks. Her water tanks store around 100,000 liters of fresh water. Amenities. At anchor stabilizers, jacuzzi, on deck, elevator, lift, helipad, beach club, tender garage, swimming platform, air conditioning, gym, swimming pool. Launched in 2012, Topaz 147.25 meters (483 feet) is a custom-built luxury motor yacht constructed by Lursen in Bremen, Germany, estimated to have cost 400 million pounds to build, around 527 million United States dollars. Topaz is among the largest private luxury yachts in the world and is owned by billionaire Mansour bin Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayyan, deputy prime minister of the United Arab Emirates and member of the Abu Dhabi royal family. He is also owner of the Manchester City Football Club. Topaz has been designed to accommodate up to 62 guests in 26 cabins. She is also capable of carrying up to 79 crew. The Tim Hayward designed vessel features a steel displacement hull, an aluminium superstructure and consists of eight decks. 
the eight decks are connected by a lift that provides access to the helicopter and swimming platforms, and to a fully equipped gym with the latest in sports technology. It is equipped a swimming pool, two jacuzzis, a conference room, movie theater and two helipads. Topaz boasts tender boats that can be reached from both sides of the ship, or through the stern, where there is a terrace and a large deck with stairs to provide access to the water as well as a variety of water toys stored in the hold, jet skis, inflatable boats, catamaran and a mini submarine. Topaz's cruising speed is 22.9 knots and the maximum speed is estimated to be around 25.5 knots. The mega yacht also has stabilizers to ensure comfort on board when the yacht at anchor, particularly in rough water. Its manufacturers and designers have not disclosed details of its interior, given it's owned by a member of the royal family, however, it is known that Disdale was briefed to create an informal, beach house, style of decor. For further details of this beautiful mega yacht, and other stunning super yachts. Powered by two VEM Saxon work, DKMEF 1241 to 16 volts, 4474 horsepower diesel engines, one Wartzela 2100 kilowatts diesel electric engines and propelled by her twin, it's undoubtedly a masterpiece. Released in 2013, the yacht costs around $605 million. With its release, it dethroned Roman Abramovich's Eclipse Superyacht from being the largest yacht in the world. Eclipse is 533 feet long, whereas the superyacht Azum boasts 590 feet. It's 57 feet longer than Abramovich's yacht. What's interesting about Azum is that engineers took four years to assemble it. The CEO of the German shipbuilding company, Lursen mentioned that the construction of the yacht employed over 4,000 people. This is a fantastic contribution to a man's financial stability. The Azum is a deluxe yacht which flaunts incredible complexity in its detail and design. The superyacht can accommodate up 36 guests, advancing the Azum as the largest superyacht in terms of guest capacity. A crew of 60 people is required on board to maintain the yacht, alone. This yacht is one of the most expensive masterpieces, and will for yearly maintenance cost around 10% its full price. This means the owner must spend over $60 million every year to keep Azum in prime condition before cruising off to a foreign destination. The Azum can reach speeds of up to 31.5 knots and is considered one of the fasted superyachts. This is quite a rare speed limit for such an immense superyacht. The Lursen did the technical engineering of the superyacht. The exterior design was crafted by Nauta Yachts, whereas Christoph Leone assembled the interior. It's merely spectacular in terms of luxury and amenities. The construction is designed with high quality and rigid materials to ensure maximum safety as well as comfort. Many consider Azum to surpass Abramovich's yacht in terms of amenities easily. Keep in mind that Eclipse comes with two helipads, pools, cinema, gym, and more amazing features. Once you're on board, you'll be completely blown away by its uniqueness in terms of luxury. Each cabin is plushly designed to make you feel unique, as well as comfortable. The yacht currently belongs to Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed al Nahyan. In the world of soccer, Roman Abramovich is a popular figure as he owns the leading English club, Chelsea. The Russian businessman helped the Blues to become a big spender in the transfer market, bringing brilliant players like Aryan Robin, Didier Drogba and Fernando Torres etc. to offer the beautiful game for the club supporters across the world. As well as the Chelsea football team, which is a beauty in soccer fields, Abramovich owns another marvel, a private yacht named Eclipse. The 162.5 meters long beauty, Eclipse, is the world's second largest and one of the most expensive superyachts. With an estimated cost of 590 million, 340 million euros, the Eclipse has been owned by its current owner since December 2010. A synonym for luxury, this superyacht is best suitable for all adventure and water sports activities in addition to providing splendid trips to cultural and historical destinations. Built by renowned German shipbuilder Blohm plus Voss, the Eclipse was launched in June 2009 after a total of five years of design, development and testing. Before its final delivery, several sea trials were done starting in May 2009 at Kristiansand, Norway. When delivered, Eclipse won the spot for the largest superyacht in the world, beating 162 meters long M. Y. Dubai of Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Prime Minister of the United Arab Emirates. Eclipse retained the title until the arrival of 180 meters long Azum, the private yacht of UAE President Khalifa bin Zayed bin Sultan Al Nahyan, in 2013. Currently managed by Blue Ocean Yacht Management, Eclipse was selected as the Motor Yacht of the Year in 2011 at the World Superyacht Awards. 
the Bermuda flagged Lloyd's Register class yacht has a gross tonnage of 13,000 tons. Offering the latest propulsion technology for maximum speed performance, Eclipse is powered by a diesel electric dual propulsion system with 4 MTU 20 volts 1163 TB93 marine diesel engines. However, even in this context, the 98.4 foot History Supreme stands out. This superyacht is believed to be the most expensive in the world, even nine years after it was sold to a Malaysian businessman. The final tally, $4.8 billion. That's a lot of money to pay for a boat, even when your net worth is estimated at $14.5 billion, as of 2020. Unconfirmed reports have it that the richest man in Malaysia and the second richest man in Southeast Asia Robert Kuik is the happy owner of this insanely priced vessel, which he commissioned from luxury jeweler and designer Stuart Hughes back in 2011. Hughes himself went public with the announcement of the job, which prompted several major media outlets both in the UK and Australia to cover it. He never said outright that Kuik was the buyer, but he gave plenty of hints in that direction. He also offered specifics on the boat.